In this PowerPoint, I'm going to walk you through some elements of each of the three episodes that you were to watch this week. We'll start with The Wedding of River Song. When the show starts, we begin in London, and London is all wrong. Um, different events are all happening simultaneously. Um, some of these things that I put on the screen. And it's obvious by seeing a uh, Roman centurion stop at a traffic light. Um, we see hot air balloons floating through the air carrying cars. We see pterodactyls, etc. And we learn that time is always 5.02 p.m. April 22nd, which was the day that the, uh, the exact time and day that the doctor was shot by the impossible astronaut on the shores of Lake Silencio. And so Winston Churchill, who is in charge of this age um, in England, has a soothsayer, and he calls him to explain what's going on again. And we find out that the soothsayer is actually the doctor. In a flashback, the doctor tells us that he needs to figure out why he has to die at Lake Silencio. And we see him tracking down Father Gideon, um, who is actually a Tesselecta, and Father Gideon leads him to Gantok, the silence agent, so that we end up finally being led to Dorian Malavar, the blue man who was had his head cut off um, by the headless monks. And so here he then gives somewhat of a prophecy to the doctor, and he insists that if the doctor lives, then on the fields of Trenzalore, at the fall of the 11th, when no creature can speak falsely or fail to answer, a question that must never be answered will be asked. He says it's the first question hidden in plain sight. He asks if the doctor wants to know the question. The doctor agrees and is told the question, but we don't hear it. The doctor then grabs Dorium's head in the box starts to try and do kind of a farewell tour, finds out an old friend has died, and he really kind of comes to terms with the fact that he's probably going to die. And so he gives the Tesselecta invitations to deliver to bring Amy Pond, Rory, and River Song to Lake Silencio. So that while they're there, we see the impossible astronaut rising from the lake and killing um, that now we know it's River Song trapped in the suit she has no control of the suit and she's going to kill the doctor and after the shots are rung out he doesn't die and in concern he asks River what has she done and at this moment the world shatters and it stays April 22nd 5.02 p.m forever until time finally disintegrates. Um, the Doctor and Churchill discuss these events. Then they notice that they're holding weapons, they're in a defensive stance, there's tally marks on them so they realize the silence is around them and at that moment a grenade rolls in and Amy Pond comes marching in and then she shoots the Doctor at this point.